All right, um, it is, whoa, it is, what time is it? It's 10.30 in the morning. Um, we have not heard from the vet yet. Ern called over there earlier, and they said they had not brought him into surgery yet, but he would be going in in a little bit, and then I should be able to pick him up today. Hopefully all is well. Um, I miss my dog really bad right now. I was really awful not sleeping with him here last night. I'm not still in the best mood, but I'm looking forward to picking him up and pretty much cuddling with him for the next, like, three days. So that's going to be what I'm going to do. My entire weekend is going to be cuddling with Omar. Um, but yeah, so today is just kind of all over the place. We do have a drop this weekend, and I've been, like, slacking on talking about it because all this shit's going on. There's actually a Happy Cry AI collab dropping this. Collabing with myself. I like to collab with my split personalities. The Hey I P Cry. Hey I I be cry. Dropping, we have the Da Vinci shirt, which is artificial intelligence. We have the wings, Jordan, Kanye, whatever you want to call it, uh, Happy Cry shirt, and then there's also a Happy Cry AI collab tee. Regular time, Sunday, 10 a.m. And all of the photos will be on my social medias. So I don't really post them here because I'm gonna do a pop them up on the screen. I mean, I guess I could pop them up on the screen. Pop, pop, pop. Other than that, Ern's on the way. I'm gonna smoke a joint, I'm gonna chill. I'm trying to get through this afternoon as easily as possible. It's a dirty urn. Gotcha. Yeah, you were taking it with it, though. Nice. Why no shoes yesterday? Why no shoes yesterday? Oh, because you know what I was in the fucking about. mood to talk about yeah, shoes. Yeah, I forget that you have to. What are the... you, a fucking troll on the internet? No. Why no shoes yesterday? I don't want to no, talk about I fucking shoes. I forgot that you didn't talk about them already. Because I think we shot them. No, I'm you're like, such a fucking dickbag. I just I get to no, the end and I'm like, wait. You're a dick. I'm you get to dick. the end and you're like, wait, I literally said at the end of the vlog that I wasn't going to do the shoes. I said I wasn't I in the fucking mood it, for it. And you just yeah. asked me why no shoes all casual as if it was like a fucking choice. You're a but fucking I, cox. Jesus Christ. There you go. Uh, sitting here chilling, smoking a fucking goddamn joint. You I come didn't to me mean like it like that. Bitch, I know you were. I called you, you to see fucking, how you were yeah, yesterday. So don't now. act like I didn't. Yeah, and then today you forgot that I was fucking. I didn't off. forget you were pissed. Why I no just shoes? didn't. I forgot that you don't talk about them ahead of time. That's it. And I remember shooting them, so dude, that was it. This dude. Somebody. Fucking prototypes drop Saturday. This fucking guy. Why well, no shoes? What are you, a nine year old in the fucking YouTube comments right now? It's not what I meant. I didn't come over here to troll you. I swear to God, dude. That's not even what I meant. That's a good thing, because today I'll fucking whoop your ass for it. It's not in the fucking mood today, dude. <laughs> fucking asshole. You want me to talk about the shoes? No, you don't know anything about shoes. No. Oh. You can barely fucking walk right. Why uh, uh, no shoes? I'm good, I'm good. I'm oh, it's too much for you, little half a joy. People think you're pregnant. Because of yesterday's vlog, because oh, of your other yeah. situation. Yeah. <laughs> you still yeah. good? Yeah. Uh, okay. Pretty so I don't really know what we're going to do today, because I literally don't want to do shit. I'm running home. And then it'll be like an hour and a little more, and then I'll get the car. And I'll come back. And we'll get Omar. Just call me, obviously. I'm sure you will. Yeah. If you hear anything. Yeah. That was a great, that was a great few hours. YouTube and Twitch. Uh, conspiracies, Illuminati's. Freaked out shit. Fuck am I watching? What are we doing? What's the meaning of it all? Mm, what is it all me? Find out next week on Illuminati. Illuminati. Earn Illuminati. Earn Illuminati. Earn Illuminati. Earn Illuminati. The Earn Illuminati. Earn Illuminati. Alright, I'll all right. be back. Run home, Jack. I'll see you later. <laughs> you know what that reference was from? No. A hook. Oh, yeah. <laughs> Jeez. Slam the fucking door. All right. So we're still waiting to hear about Omar. And we just spent like three hours in a YouTube wormhole on Twitch. Because the day is about distracting myself. Now I'm going to, I guess, go to the gym. Really hungry today. It's probably just because I'm stressed out. And I'm like starving, but I'm fucking starving today. So I'm um, gonna get the gym stuff in, then I'm going to eat, and then hopefully go pick up Omar. A very light kick drop this morning, but I got the bleaker indigo pant, and I got them for free, because I had a gift card. Shout out to the homie Bigfoot who got me the gift card, who just gave it to me for my birthday. And got me the jacket, and all three of those palace towels. Put you onto some game real quick. If you're not fucking with Adidas towel, you're fucking up. Well, specifically, Palace Adidas towels are the fucking move. This sucks because I'm probably gonna blow it up where I can't get them anymore, but they just dropped three towels, and these are the best fucking towels. I have the old blue Palace towel. These are all, like, assuming World Cup towels. Could be wrong, I guess. We got this one. Uh, what is this, Germany? 
right? Germany? Italy. Maybe these aren't World Cup. I don't know. And France? So yeah, these are sick. These are like 80 bucks. They are worth it. Bigfoot still cooks for me all the time, so he's been like a day one on the ship. And then I have some lenses coming in the mail today. I don't think there's any shoes. I know that my sample mid, another Alexander Wang, or two Alexander Wangs are on the way, but I don't think they're gonna get here today. It'll probably be next week. And then, um, yeah, I think just lenses today. Which I'm excited. I think I have basically all of the lenses that fit this new camera, which I really, really fuck with this new camera. It's, it's awesome. Super awesome. All right, I'm gonna hit the gym up. I'm gonna get out of here, and then I'll be back. Peace. Uh, still no word from Omar, the vet, and I'm kind of losing my mind a little bit right now. So I thought the best thing to do now, because I spent most of the morning on Twitch and just fucking around, working on music, I drew a little bit, but I'm gonna go ahead and review these shoes for you and talk about this and kill 30 minutes. Because honestly, in like 20 minutes, Aaron's gonna be back and I'm gonna go ahead to the vet anyway, regardless of what they call. AM4, well this is the AM4 NYC box. I don't know where the London box is. It's out there. It looks just like this one. I guarantee you they're not fake. If you can prove that I have fake shoes, I'll write you a huge check. The AM4 London is right here. Bah, 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 bah. So we've looked at a few AM4s. I'm just gonna go over this one real quick and then I'll talk to you guys about the differences uh, in all of them. This one still says made in Germany, which is just funny too. So if you don't know, now you know, Speed Factory is a new thing from Adidas, pushing innovation forward. Idea being essentially from consumers being, hey, we want shoes that fit us perfectly. I want everything in my world catered to me, including my footwear, and this is Adidas. Adidas's answer to that. Uh, right now, we're definitely in like a beta stage of this. Each shoe that drops right now is city located, is city themed, this one being London. We looked at Paris, New York, 747 LA. There's supposedly another LA, there's supposedly a Shanghai, and there's a Tokyo coming as well. They chose runners from each location, photo mapping and compensation for the running environment. So I don't really understand some of the features specific to some locations like i don't know what makes this more london you know like london versus paris there's a little bit of a difference but not too much like the differences aren't crazy at all all the fuse patterns there's no glue in this shoe used also everything's fused so the fuse patterns on this are very identical if not exact and then these patterns here that look like they kind of go in really no actual shape whatsoever this is actually a byproduct of photo mapping and all of this fusing is where the support is added so photo during photo mapping tests they realize these are the areas that need more support so they added more support boost and it's not like your ultra boost boost it's a completely different boost ride I would say this is more firm. You're gonna get a way more response out of this and it's definitely more of a performance model and not lifestyle. Which is why this upper is not your normal PK. It's definitely more rigid. Still super comfortable and very nice on foot, but it's just not, it's not a lifestyle shoe. It's not meant to be a lifestyle shoe. It's not meant to be a hype shoe. It's just meant to be a functional, catered, customizable shoe beta. Because we're getting there. We're obviously gonna get to the point where we're all photo mapping our own products, not just shoes. Like we're, we're gonna be printing this shit out at home or having it drone delivered or something. Having a robot companion that makes it, I don't know, but these are sick. Speaking of AI, there's also an NF chip in the tongue so you can look up extra information. Comfort on the shoe is actually really nice and it's a very simple design. It's basically a sock-like collar. There's a couple of reinforced panels on the inside that are mainly for comfort. Nice squishy pad in the forefoot and in the heel. The heel goes back in an arc so you can pull up onto your foot a little bit easier. This doesn't rub the back of your heel. Nice innovations in the shoe just for comfort alone, just for running and comfort. I don't run anything but my mouth but still they're comfortable as fuck just to wear three stripes on the toe all of them have three stripes on the toe except for the la pair and then floating torsion system which is supposedly a better torsion system from going from heel to toe as well as this new sole which is not a continental sole but this studded grip is supposed to help you turn corners quicker yes, that's what they say this should help you i'm not sure i'm trying to get Ern to get a pair so he can run and tell you since he likes to run so much and then as far as the new york pairs i'm not going to do an on feet for this because it is a regular black shoe i don't think you guys really need to see this one too. There's a couple of changes on this one. It's the only one that I noticed any change on. There is a slight, and I do mean slight, bit more boost in the forefoot, the toe box area. There's a little more boost. Uh, the upper, the upper is definitely more rigid. It's definitely got that like tough grit. It's just like, I don't know. It's just, it's just like 
is just more, it's definitely more durable upper than the other ones. It's got that New York grit to it. And then the fuse paneling is completely different. So you have fuse paneling in completely different areas. The heel has more support. Cause you're gonna be running on concrete, they did give you a little more boost as well as just a lot more fuse tape. More, there's different support panels on this shoe than there are in previous as you can see for yourself orange insole which i do really like the contrast the orange insole and all of them they are true to size the insole does come out but there i wouldn't really suggest it uh, but there is going to be a little room in your toe most likely your true size you're not going to notice it in the sense of it being like floppy because this collar part of the shoe sit, fits really well all right, so these are all of the a and four so far except for the women pair and the other pairs that are pink there's more coming there's a parlay coming they're fire i think they're dope it's a cool concept we're obviously um headed down this road and i like it i don't think these are going to stay hype i don't think they're supposed to stay hype i just think it's a completely different thing and uh the future of footwear really you can still get these i believe on adidas.com you can still get the paris ones on adidas.com do believe that these sold out these are exclusive to the 747 so all right i would say that that's the day but it's not the day i'm gonna wait on uh iron and see what's up and then we'll figure out what the day is The vet just called. Ern's on the way. Well, the vet didn't call. Ern called the vet. Omar's out of surgery. We're going to get him right now. Just fucking tripod out. Oh, jeez, man. I literally haven't slept normal. I don't know why I just got so nervous that I had to be in there, but oh, huge relief. Yeah. This says fragile on it. She brought me the car. I got in it. Now I'm here. Boom. Yeah, I feel better. Nice. It's so annoying. They should just give you a webcam. Yeah. A text alert. Like as soon as he's stitched up, it's like a text alert should go out. Well, last time they did, they, they called should do it like Postmates, where you get an update every step of the way. Omar has woken. Yeah. Omar is not having breakfast, but he wants it really bad right now. Omar's still waiting. Yeah, I'm with it. That's it's what like, I'm saying. I don't think I don't think they understood this. Yeah. They understand? Like I've been literally fucking mentally paralyzed <laughs> yesterday. Yeah. I can't do anything. Yeah, I hate that feeling. Yeah, it's really, yeah, gone. then you get mad at yourself too because you can't get shit done. It's like being an action hero and having a weakness, you know what I'm saying? Yeah. Should have should have had to kill my dog at like four years old or something to prepare me for these moments, you know? Toughen me up. They should have just, parents should have made me just strangle my dog to death. Like, here we yeah. got a puppy. And after two years, like, oh, you have to kill What? Him. What? Yeah. <laughs> it's gonna happen eventually. Like, listen, we're gonna have to teach you this lesson and you're gonna have to do that. Because today I've just been a huge pussy. I'm like sitting around like, God damn it. He's gonna blow their phone up like I've been listening to Drake all day. Ugh. Thought about in the middle of the night is going to kidnap him. So I can't get too mad at me. It's my dog. Sir, did you just break into the veterinary? Yeah, he's my dog. I was just keeping him until the morning. He's got an appointment. Check the books. <laughs> I miss him, all right? I can't sleep. I didn't touch anything yeah, else. Yeah, I didn't touch shit. Fucking dusty ass veterinarian place. What am I yeah. gonna do? Steal this fucking oil painting? Fuck out of here. What is this? The Thomas Crown affair? I want my dog? My fucking dog. I love how we always have to go pick him up during rush hour, too. Like, hey, yeah. not quite stressed enough today. Yeah. We're gonna put you in the gauntlet. Hunger Games. This is fucking Hunger Games yeah, in real life. It's taking me a long Uber bought its mapping system from uh, <coughs> from a trash company. Yeah, I wonder if he knows us. 
Baby. <laughs> He's like, yo, let's, what's up? <laughs> Come on, we'll moped the city together. No. The only time we're mopeding a city is in, like, fucking Haiti. Yeah. It's like, oh, this makes more sense. You can get in and out of shit. There's a Martha's Vineyard up on Cape Cod. We always used to get them. I bet that's so fucking boring, though, because well, nobody, like, everybody's just so fucking, like, proper and shit, and then there's, like, one asshole who's drunk on the moped. Oh, I well, guess that whole vibe just stresses me out already. Me and Ethan. I can't believe you just ruined your I new polo shorts, David. <laughs> <laughs> That's what you get for goofing around. <coughs> Those shorts were $78. Oh, this is the first I time I ate weed brownies, dog. Dude, and your whole fucking origin story is so whack. Whoa, oh, what's up, hey. fucking Tangy Goddess? Get the fuck out. <laughs> <laughs> she was straight all tangerine. Yeah, everything. No, mm -hmm. so I started eating weed brownies on the beach. Me and Ethan cooked a whole sheet of them, and we packed a them, sheet. and we were so... A like, sheet of brownies. Yeah, you know, like a sheet pan. Pan? And cut them. Yeah, pan, pan. Sheet pan. You made a batch of brownies, mother. Fire. Yeah, batch okay. Some people call it sheet, though. But who makes one wheat brownie? Can you even make one? No, wheat but I'm just saying. So we I brought... assumed when you said you made brownies that you made an entire batch. All right, well, not I... that you guys constructed one brownie like a fucking 3D printer. I ate one and ate Ethan ate one. We waited like 15 minutes, didn't feel anything. Of course not. Yeah, we didn't know. <laughs> Everyone's another. everybody's edible story. This is like everybody's so. story. Yeah, I guess it is really. <laughs> All right, so how long have you? But many juice? here's the best part. This is where the moped comes. In. We got so fucking high. We had four of them each. They kicked in in the middle of riding mopeds and we ran out of gas. Mm. Blazing hot sun, it was the hottest day of the year that summer. We had no sunblock, we're just in like shorts and t-shirts. Blazing hot sun, no blazing hotties. No Two blazing dudes, hotties. high as fuck, let's yeah. just get it. Yeah, we were like 15. We went, and yeah, because at 15, no blazing hotties existed in your No, life. we did, we fucked, oh we fucked two 30 year olds whoa, that week. Whoa, whoa, Wait whoa. a minute. Chill. Huh. Oops, I'm not here. playing. Whoa. Oh, that came later. Whoa, somebody so, came later. Yeah. All right, let's go. Story. Long story short, <laughs> we, we ran up on some farmland where we saw a gasoline thing sitting there. So we, all gas. Yeah, it wasn't gas. At that point, it was straight fucking alcohol because it had been sitting in the sun or whatever it was. Oh, my God. It destroyed the engine. We had to call the shop. We told the shop we have no idea. We're like, oh, we ran out of... It's like we, a fucking Hardy Boys episode. We're like, I don't know what happened. The things just stopped working. Right, it's got... Right. I don't know. I don't know. It's got a, it's got half a tank left. We told them, but half the tank was just filled with shit. I don't know whatever shit. happened. Who shit in the tank? No, I mean this guy's getting artsy. Look at this abandoned warehouse. I will take some pictures. Yeah. Where'd you take that award-winning photograph? Behind Larkburger, man. I used to fucking hate it in high school when you'd have photography class. All right, your assignment. Blah blah blah. Take some photos. Blah, blah, blah. Someone always came back with a goddamn photo of a fucking manhole cover. I see, this is so depressing. I was like, we live in such a shitty part of North Carolina. Yeah. The only thing of interest that people can find to take pictures of a manhole cover. 60 fucking kids in class and 40 of the photos are black and white manhole covers. Like a Ninja Turtle gallery in this <laughs> bitch. Looking like a Ninja Turtle string theory. Like, he working for Shredder? Shredder. Alright. Oh, easy there, bro. Easy there with the... your fucking electric yeah. car, okay? Why don't you stay plugged in a little longer there? See his headrest? No. Um, it was like those, were those like a uh, pullover thing that the hippies wear with like, they look like the dashiki? Mexican blankets. A uh, poncho? Yeah, but like, you know, the colorful ones. like they, Baja. That's what, I got one in Cape Cod. That was the thing in the- You, what the fuck? Are we advertising for Cape Cod? We got beautiful Hey, beaches. beautiful vacations. Check the link here. There, I'd like save up money, meet hot girls, go cop a Baja. Buy yo-yo. Like, yo. Yo, yo, buy a fucking yo-yo. Hey, no, you know, hey, what hey, else? <laughs> know what else? You and your yo-yo and a Baja out fucking inside the comic book store. Fucking. <laughs> Hey, what's up? My parents are at the vineyard. Oakley's. Want to go to the pool? Oakley's were big. Like, in the Oakley. No, no, no. Oakley's weren't big. <laughs> you just wore Oakley's. Oakley's were big before you fuck it in the comments. Or it's a joke. So, Someone's like, Oakley's were actually huge, Teddy. You're a fucking hater. They had those 3M color changing windbreakers. They're not 3M. They not were 3M. color changing. Yeah, You're talking like, about hyper color. Who made that? Hyper color. That's what it was called. Well, it was originally called Hyper. Yeah, hi the name of the shit's not called Hypercolor. The name of the the name of the main company was Hypercolor, though. I'm pretty sure. I know, but I'm trying to think of the. Remember name. they had the dude in the suit, and when he got warm, he was in his beach clothes. Yes. That was a Hypercolor shirt. I'm almost like positive. Oh like, wait, yeah, you're talking. We're talking about two different things. You're talking about that stuff, but I'm talking about the 3M. It's almost like Zeno looking. Like yeah, it's like a purple. The shell. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh, the Oasis. Shit. Yes, Oasis. Yeah, yeah, yeah. That was the brand. That mm. I thought was the shit, dude. I had an Oasis windbreaker. With that my didn't Oakleys. change color with your like. That, that just like had a weird sheen to it, though. I didn't change colors. Yeah, I guess not change colors. Just walking with my headphones through Provincetown was mm. good. What's up, girls? What's up, ladies? What's up, ladies? New York Mets hat. What's up? Yeah. Got my Archie's comics in my back pocket. Yeah. My board shorts. I'm living like the Hardy Boys. Man, we do. <laughs> 
We're fucking party boys. Party boys. <laughs> I'm gonna just start buddies. redoing children's books with me as the main character. Yeah, you as Humpty Dumpty will go real well. Yeah, Harold in the Purple Crayon. It could be Ern in the Purple Crayon. Oh, that one sounds weird already. No, it's You and your fucking Purple Crayon need to chill. <laughs> oh, yeah, that's so weird. I never wore the pants with all the little, like, lobsters on them. Well, though, that's you good. know what I'm talking At about? At least you have your fucking dignity, yeah, right? Yeah, and son's out there talking shit I saw. Who? Jordan's son? Yeah. Talking shit about what? I don't know. Something about somebody dissed Jordan. Needs to check himself, dude. He ain't done nothing but be born. I don't yeah. know why, why he talks so fucking proud. much. It's kind of annoying. He said he was talking shit to Drake or something. He, I quoted the tweet and said, this is pretty ironic. Because he's like, good luck being in Adidas forever. It's like, you were born into oh, a brand. That's what, what it was. That's Calm down, bro. Shred a thumb with the sheriff's office. What could it possibly be? Shredding up like documents or something. <laughs> I don't know. You know how they like collect pills and shit? They'll no. be like, bring all your, I'm bring all your, oh yeah, they'll say like, bring all your expired pills to your local so that people don't have a bunch of Xanax. Sounds like a hustle. Like, we're trying to get high. We got, a, we got the player's ball coming up. Yeah. So we need a bunch of these Xanax and perks. Get your grandma's, <laughs> get your grandma's shit. Bring them in. We'll give you some coupons. Yeah, that's basically what it is. She give you get out of jail for you. Like, look, man, this could I could have turned this into a crime. I could have taken these pills, which have been illegal. I didn't. I brought them to you. So can you please give me one get out of jail free yeah. card? It's like, thank you. Yeah. Collect them shits. By the time you're 60, you got a stack. And you're just like, I'm about to wild out today, fam. I got a stack of fucking get out of jail free cards. Ain't nobody stopping. Pop! You just leave a whole stack. You're just making it rain. <laughs> yeah, what now? You can't touch me. Like they call him for backup. Like, well, don't even bother. Why? It's Teddy. He's got fucking 7,000 get out of jail free cards. What is this cop doing? He's pulling people over? Well, he needs to fucking pull his ass over and off the fucking street. Yeah. What the fuck could this person possibly have done? We're all going seven miles an hour. Yeah. Sir, I noticed Sir. your rear yeah. tail light was out. When I was following and you. I wanted to fuck up the rest of the yeah, traffic. Yeah, trying to fuck up everybody's day here. Look, she's like, get back inside the cookie chair. Whoa, 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 whoa. <laughs> Ern, what the fuck? People ask we where the We gotta get the dash cam. Yeah, camera exactly. Camera. People ask where the dash cam is. You know why the dash cam is gone? Because I'm not editing a another fucking full piece of footage every night. It's fine, but we had, you know, four or five feet. It wasn't as close four as Four or that. five feet? I'll make sure to slow down your facial reaction as you notice that you're about to hit a RAV4. What's there worse? You know what's worse than driving a RAV4? Yeah. Having to pay for someone else's that you crashed into. Body Hold on. Oh. Hey, what are you saying? Oh, okay. Can I him? Sure, that's fine. Right. Sorry. That's okay, I just wanted to ask. Hi. <laughs> Oh, he's a tired guy. Hey, Ella. Out of it? Yeah. <laughs> yeah, but we're kind of purposely doing that. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, perfect. <laughs> yeah. All right, we'll see you guys later. Thank you, Thank you so much. You want to sit in the back with him? Yeah. Slide, well, okay, hold on. Hold on, I will. Uh. You're home, bud. Some water. Birds are here. Thanks for my samples. Ooh. No matter. No matter. It's hot. Yeah. The silver looks so fucking good. Yeah. All right, Omar. Let's go lay down. Hey, that's enough water. Call me. Okay, come on. That's enough. You're not supposed to have a bunch. I'm sorry, you're not supposed to, you have a little more, that's it. Alright, so we can finally get back to somewhat of a normal existence. Sample shirts for this week's drop. Just a bunch. AI. Nice. That's dope. Good idea. Toy. Appreciate it, Ryan. Thanks for the gift, my G. Look at that thing. Got the 22s. The 28 macro. 28 macro. Boop. 18 to 150. Mm. Boom. So, a lot more lenses. We now have 
one, what, three, five lenses for this new camera. I'm selling an old lens, which pretty much paid for all three of these. That's positive. All right, so that's the day. Um, this whole weekend, I'm gonna be spent figuring out Patreon and Kickstarter stuff, finalizing it, hanging out with my precious baby dog, and just appreciating everything that I have. Uh, I hope you guys do the same. Thanks for being here. I love you. Peace.